Uh, I also really want to zero in on the Encinitas Marketplace, one of the best places, not just in San Diego, on the planet uh, with our real estate elite, Linda Moore. Let's go ahead and take a look at that market, uh, Encinitas. Encinitas is the quintessential California coastal beach community that combines a healthy living lifestyle and the perfect climate, an average of about 72 degrees year round. The coastline extends over six miles and contains some of the best bathing and surf beaches in America. It was named one of the top 20 best surf towns in the world by National Geographic. Encinitas is divided basically into four unique areas. Old Encinitas is a romantic beach town loyal to its culture over the past 100 years. It's an old world kind of beach vibe, typified by a mixture of unique shops, restaurants, and nightlife along Highway 101. The biggest local draws are Moonlight Beach, recently renovated with a cafe, showers, and rental facilities. Pacific Station is anchored by Whole Foods and includes unique retail and restaurants. There are many surf shops and plenty of places to check out, including the famous Surfing Madonna Mosaic Sculpture and the Union Kitchen and Tap. Don't miss the classic car show on Thursday nights during the summer. New Encinitas is composed of newer neighborhoods and homes, bordered by central retail area. With All right, so she's an award-winning realtor, uh, been in the business for 25 years, I think on TV, is a TV personality for about 60 seconds now. <laughs> Linda Moore, good to have you yeah. in here. And great you've been on the radio here. show quite a bit recently, talking about some yeah. of the cool things happening in the Encinitas market. Obviously, we just saw a great video there. Danny, I'm really excited to have you here. You're with the Gaylord Hanson team, which is one of the most reputable mortgage teams in San Diego. Uh, realtors know you, financial advisors know you, the mortgage guys know you as, as the good guys, pros pros. So you're going to talk about this Fresh Start program. Right, so yes. we're going to understand that a bit better. Uh, let's start with Linda here in, in Encinitas. I know that you guys work together and you help finance. You help find the dream home. You help finance it. But uh, first and foremost, congratulations on an award that you just won. We're going to show it on the screen here. Three-time recipient of the National Leadership Award with Coldwell Banker. So congratulations on Thank that. You. Tell us about the, uh, the award. Thanks. So tell us about it. Well, the award uh, really has to do with being the number one associate in the county of San Diego. And I've been really fortunate to achieve that award three times. Wow. Well, congratulations. Thank you. Uh, as far as uh, Encinitas goes, price ranges are a little bit higher there. We just had Kurt Wanabo talking about Carmel Valley. I, I noticed in the video, I mean, I was even learning while I was watching the video, there's the old Encinitas and then the new Encinitas. What are we talking about in, in price ranges so people can gauge it a little bit better? Well, uh, there's four distinct areas of the 92024 zip code, and everyone has special things about it. Um, basically, um, the price ranges are higher when you get toward the beach, of course, which is Lucadia and old Encinitas, particularly west of the 101. Um, then when you get a little bit farther east, you get a lot more for your money, say uh, east of El Camino Real. Um, and then we get to a Liebenhide because those properties have quite large lots and many of them are custom homes, then that can be even more expensive as well. Got it. Well, you know, when you're talking about buying something, often the price is important, but then there's the cost. So let's bring in the guru, Danny, here to help us with this. So if I would have had a gun to my head and had to predict, predict interest rates at the beginning of the year, I would have guessed they'd be quite a bit higher than they are now. So thankfully I didn't. Uh, now we don't have a crystal <laughs> you ball. You and me both, Greg. But yeah, let's talk about 2014 and then what you think is going to happen in 2015. Well, 2014 was a really interesting year because, like you said, all economists were predicting rates in the high fours by this point, and here we are hovering in the high three percent, 3.75, 3.875, depending on qualification criteria sure. and all that. So just an incredible change. Uh, next year is going to be really exciting, I think. Um, I, I believe that we're going to have these low trends for the next couple of months, but once the Fed starts acting in you know, the second quarter of next year, uh, we might be in for a little bit of a shift up. I would have to think so. Yeah, exactly. You know, so again, no Can't crystal like balls and, and again, no guns to the head here. You've got a program here called Fresh Start. First time I heard about it was yesterday. So this <laughs> is a program, you can see it on your screen here. This is offered by the Gaylord Hansen team. It, uh, it looks like a pretty amazing program. We're going to show some of the qualifications of it, but if you could speak to what this does for potential buyers. 
this, this program, Craig, is really a game changer because what it does is allow people with some derogatory credit events to get back into the housing market. So essentially what, what has happened is Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac have changed the rules from with 20% down payment, used to be you can get into, into a house two years after a short sale. They moved that up in August to four years, which took a lot of people out of the, the buying mode. And what the Fresh Start program has done is brought those people back to the table because even one day out of a short sale, foreclosure, bankruptcy, or mortgage lates, we can get somebody back into a new loan. Again, 20% yeah. down, there's some compensating factors that so make this- So it's not this, subprime. No, not subprime. No, we we don't to need to be scared that these loose lending programs <laughs> are coming back. So this is a, a unique program that has compensating factors, money down, DTIs, I'm sure, are weighed into this. Exactly right. But if you've had that one-time issue, if you've had the bankruptcy or foreclosure, or short sale, which is in many cases a byproduct of the market, yet you have money in the bank or a solid job, there might be options for you. I encourage you to connect with the uh, Gaylord Hanson team. Danny, it's great information. Uh, Linda, real quick, explain how important these guys are to you. Very important, not only to the buyers that I work with, but also to the sellers, too. A lot of times we'll have them cross-qualify, uh, people that come to my listings just to make sure they're really qualified for the property. And uh, oftentimes the buyer will end up using the Gaylord Hansen team, and then I know and the seller knows that we're going to get the job done well and quickly. Well, it really speaks to the point that as the realtor, as a top-producing award-winning realtor, you're, you're the hub of the wheel. But it's so important to have a good mortgage team, uh, a financial planner. Once you buy the house, you're going to need an estate plan, tax plan. So a lot comes together. As you can see, uh, Linda has a team that supports her. Gaylord Hansen team is one of the best in the business. Linda, always good to have you on the show. First time Great on TV, here. and we've had yeah. you on radio plenty of times, so yeah. we'll have you back again soon. Thank you so Wonderful. much. Wonderful. Thank you. If you want to connect with Linda, lindasellsmore.com. Uh, she does amazing work up in North County and, and uh, a, a lot of respect for her and all the things that she and her team do.